What's up guys, MMA Game here, bringing you another video. This video, we, we are using Chael P. Sonnen, one of the new fighters added, the People's Champ, and I, I go through his stats right there at the beginning, so if you guys want to check out his perks or his, some of his uh, stats, then you can go ahead and uh, pause it there during the uh, beginning. But if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see some more of the new fighters, we also got Dan Henderson. Make sure to hit that, not Dan Henderson, Dan Severn. Make sure to hit that like button. And in this fight again, I am using Chael P. Sonnen at middleweight. He's available to use at light heavyweight or middleweight. This fight, I'm going up against Yoel right here. And there's one of the new mechanics right off the bat. That's actually done by holding L, L1, left bumper and left trigger. At the same time as shooting in for a double leg. You can do that with any fighter pretty much as long as they have a double leg. And... Um, and then it'll actually push them into the cage and I've been ha I've had a lot more experience using this mechanic and is very very strong um, but it also if, if they if they sprawl it at the right time it takes a lot of your stamina and you do risk getting submitted so if you if you're gonna go a lot for the wrestling you need to be pretty good at submission defense if you're gonna because you're gonna be entering into the grappling and you may get reversed and, or you may get sprawled and it might put your stamina really low and you might be you know open for certain submissions so you just want to keep that in mind but right here we're going up against Yoel and uh, looking to work this is like one of my first times using Chael I haven't, I haven't really figured out any of his combos or anything like that I'm just sort of looking to get range and punch him and try to just look for the opening and set up some of the new takedown fakes and like the new takedown mechanics that's pretty much what I wanted to do and I wanted to work the ground and pound obviously with chill and also possibly go for the submission as well I've been working on my submissions and submissions are very very deadly now in the game especially with the new takedown animations and the how it's a little bit easier to actually get the fight into the grappling position so it's easier to it's easier to use the uh, to, to use the wrestling in that way. So coming to the end of round number one here, Chael Sonnen. Really, I'm not really doing too much. I'm backing up, trying to get sh shoot certain takedowns on him, and uh, but we're we're doing the best we can here. So he's trying to. I, I spit it up a little bit. He's trying to get up. I'm trying to get up. He rolls over to half guard. And we are surviving right here. In. Coming to the end of round number one. Chael Sonnen with the reversal right there. Beautiful work. Let me know who is your favorite fighter. I've been using a lot of the uh, the new fighters. I haven't used Andre Bishop very much. I've been using Isaac Frost. Dan Severn is actually really, really good. Dan Severn is and Chael Sonnen are actually really good because of the new takedown animations just really suit their stats and like they're sort of like made for this new addition almost because, you know, once you get someone down with these guys, their stats are just maxed out pretty much I mean they're, they're pretty high their ground grappling and everything is just super high even their clinch grappling like Dan Severn is like crazy um, to fight against he's very you gotta watch that takedown like crazy and I've used him as well I got some good fights with him and you can dominate people with Dan Severn if you get their stamina low and you you know you start taking them down it's just crazy but right here boom there it is again shoot in push him into the cage he goes he pulls up into the uh, over under clinch right there trying to uh, trying to get us off him but Chael's just trying to keep that pressure he, he throws us over and backs up off the cage so you know going up against Yoel you got to be real careful I wasn't using too much head head movement in this fight a little bit but I really didn't want to risk it too much with Chael because it's just he's not really like a striker he doesn't really have those quick movements like that but I've gotten some nice hook little combos right there backing up you know Yoel making him come after us a little bit I look at that I, I shoot for the takedown and then I shoot for the uh, clinch and I actually get the clinch 
The other mechanic that I haven't had too much practice with, let me know in the comments if you guys have, is the uh, takedown fakes. I haven't had too much luck with them. Trying to fake low for the takedown and go for the clinch. I think I got it like uh, one time, but... I'm still working on the clinch as well. I'm getting way better in the clinch, way better uh, up against the fence. And, uh, yeah, the grappling is just going to be interesting with these with these takedowns. I don't know if they're going to keep everything exactly how it is or not. Like, um, let me know if you guys think any, anything's overpowered with any of the new additions. Um, if you think anything should be changed, let me know. From my experience, I do think that that um, takedown where you push them back is just a little bit too strong I don't know what you could really do to change it maybe just lower the uh, distance that you can push people back maybe that would just do it because it seems like now like it's almost a little buggy too like when it pushes them back it, it messes with the angle and um, it's uh, it's just a little bit trickier it it sort of just looks weird and it you it like you're not all the way against the cage when it pushes you up against the cage and it, but you're still there it looks it looks weird so hopefully they at least change that to make it visually look a little bit better and smoother because right now it's just a little i mean it works but it just looks a little odd but again coming to the end of round number two chael sonnen a lot of these fights where it's more grappling, you are going to be going into the later rounds. And you just have to, I mean, stay stay with it. Mix it up. That's the name of the game is mixing it up. Mixing up the grappling with the stand-up. Throwing them off. You don't know when the takedown's coming, so boom. You hit him with the uppercut. You hit him with the flying knee out of nowhere. So, right here, I think Yoel's getting a little bit too... He's getting a little bit, you know, impatient. And he rocks us right there. Boom! And he drops us with a head kick. That was a beautiful head kick. I'm surprised I didn't actually get knocked out by that. And going back and forth in the last round. The people's champ. Oh, and he goes for a desperation clinch. And I get it, but he just shrugs it off. Pressuring us up against the fence. Boom. Getting a nice body kick right there. Off cutting that angle with Chael Sonnen. I think we start cutting some angles right here. Chael Sonnen starts cutting some angles. Look at this. Boop, boop. Getting some nice little binkers right there. Setting up. He's got that little setup jab. That's what I call it. It's like a little setup jab. It's not like a strong jab. It's just like a little appalling jab. And you can use that to double jab a lot. Oh, and then right there. We're just hitting angles with the... With Chael Sonnen, he must have been working on his boxing. He's binking Yoel in the third round. Boom, boom, boom. Just popping him with that jab. So I, I kind of like that jab. Boom, we get him with a head kick, but it wasn't the right distance. This is very risky. My body is jacked up right here. Boom, but we get this hook. Hook to uppercut. Yoel goes for a lazy, a rocked shot. That would have been lethal if it landed. I'm starting to land a lot of fakes. Boom. Oh. Yoel is firing full steam ahead. So I got to regroup after that. I took some big shots. I got to regroup. Get the nice little sidestep. Do I look for the takedown? Oh, no, I don't. I rock him with the hook. Cut off the cage. And here we go. We finally got him down. It's time for the Chael Sun and ground and pound. We go into stat guard. But he gets us off. We got to work a little bit of the ground and pound, but we're back up. Chael Sonnen. Wrestler versus wrestler. Oh, a straight hook. And there it is. He gets speared right there from Sonnen. What a takedown. He just tackles him right there. The new animation. At the end of round three, what a takedown from Chael Sonnen. Big shots to the body, shots to the head. Yoel's in big trouble. And he's gonna posture up again, oh. Oh, but I think he gets us off, yeah, there we go. Back up. Time's running out. Time's running out. Oh, he gets rocked and knocked out from Chael with the head kick. 
Woo! That was a good fight, guys. That was, uh, let me know what you thought of that fight. Also, if you guys have any crazy fights featuring some of the new fighters, go ahead and uh, send that in down into the same submission form with a knockout form. And let me know that it's using the new patch fighters. And we can try to even feature some of your guys' fights as well. Because I want to see what you guys are doing with these new Isaac Frost. If you got some crazy strategies, let me know down in the comments. Thank you again for watching. Thank you for all the support. Till next time, this has been MMA Game. Peace. Peace.